Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the IPTV Smart Rest Player to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is going to be super simple and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, you need to get the app code and loader to your Fire Stick and you can actually get it totally for free from the official Amazon App Store. So just go to search on your device and here in the search bar, we need to start typing the loader. And as you can see, the loader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So we click on it and that's the app that you gotta get to your device. And now, after you got the loader, it's actually not over yet, because you still have to set it up. And now, to actually stop the app, you need to go to settings, so you click on that button with a gear icon, then you scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Let's open it. And from here, you'll have to turn on the developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, there's no need to worry because it's actually easy to make them appear. You just have to go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you'll have to start clicking on the middle button on your remote, and do that for seven times. So let's do it. And as you can see, now for me at the bottom it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case, and in your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And so, if you go back a bit, you will finally see the developer options, which now have pop out for us right here. You open them, make sure to turn on ADB debugging, then go to install on apps. From here, you just locate the loader and turn that option on. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps, which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, if you go to the list of apps on your device, which is right here, you open it, and there you'll find the loader, which is set up and ready to use on your Fire Stick. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I always recommend doing. It's, of course, connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to Argentina right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online, and that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser, and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with a camera of your phone. It works the same way, and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use the loader safely. So we just go to the list of apps from your device, you open the loader, and then here on the left side menu, it's very important that you click on home and not on browser. So once again, make sure you have clicked on home, and then in the search bar, we need to enter the code. So the code is gonna be 47827. So once again, it's 47827, that's the code that you have to enter. Then you click on go and just wait until the app starts unloading on your device. And while we are waiting, make sure to subscribe to my channel, so you would get even more content about Fire Sticks. As well as please hit the like button below this video. It truly helps me a lot, and that way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And now, just under in a couple of seconds, the load should start, and yep, yeah, there you go. Now the load will start to your device, and usually it doesn't take long, but of course it all depends on the connection speed on your device. And now just click on install and wait until the app finishes installing on your Fire Stick or Android TV device, depending on what kind of device you are using, of course. And after it was installed, you should not click on open yet, instead you press on done, 
because this way you have an option to actually delete the installation files as we don't really need them anymore on your device. So click on delete and then delete once again. This way you get rid of unnecessary files from the Fire Stick and save yourself some free space. And that's really important because by default your Fire Stick doesn't really have too much of free space on it anyway. And now if you go to the list of apps on your device, let's open it. There you'll find the IPTV Smart Rest application, which we just installed. Of course, don't forget to keep your VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble, and enjoy. See you next time. Bye-bye.